Hi guys, it's Jamie J, the Classy Cheapskate, author of Living Big on a Small Income, the Classy Cheapskate Way. Today is going to be my first ever Cheapskate Challenge! You like that? Yay! Okay, so. Okay, we're going to see who can win the most money by entering a contest or who can win the best prize. Here's the stipulation. You can't spend a penny to enter the contest and you can't spend any money on supplies. You have to use things from around your house. So, I'm going to enter a contest and I'm not going to spend any money and I want, my goal is to win thousands of dollars. So this isn't the first time I'm doing my challenge, but this is the first time I'm opening a challenge up to you guys. So post below your winnings as you enter your contest. My contest, I have not started my submission yet, um, but they're not going to do the judging for a while. So maybe next week I'll update you, let you know if I want anything. I'm, I really don't know when the judging is going to take place. I haven't even looked into it. First, let me tell you some of the contests I have won in the past. If you enter a local contest, only expect to win a few dollars, okay? If you enter a regional contest, you might be able to win a couple hundred dollars. If you enter a national contest, you might be able to win a couple thousand dollars. So the bigger the scale, the more you can win. So I urge all of you to enter national or worldwide contest. Stay away from sweepstakes. Okay, sweepstakes, they just draw a name out. You want to go with talent. Okay, even if you have no talent, I know somebody last year who took blobs of paint on a canvas and won several hundred dollars. Okay? You don't need talent. Just enter the talent contests. You always will have a chance. A few years ago I entered an Oprah contest and I spent three minutes drawing on mail envelopes that I got in the mail. I just drew on mail envelopes, I recorded it, and I won the grand prize. A trip for two to New York City, hotel stay, spending money to boot, um, and I even, with that contest, Oprah gave me free film classes in New York City for two. Okay, so uh, then also, I think it was a few years ago, I won a U-Haul coloring contest, and yes, adults, you can enter coloring contests. There, there are adult ones out there. They're rare, though. Um, I won the grand prize in that, and it was, the prize was a free roller skate for my community okay that was fun and I got my name on the side of a truck and my artwork and all that so that was pretty cool and then last year I won a contest I won a couple hundred dollars in a regional art show oh you know what I did for that one I found a blob of spray foam did you ever see spray foam for houses to fill cracks well a can exploded and I thought it kind of looked like a mutant like an alien so I stuck a glass eyeball in it and painted on some veins this is like a mad lab we've got some Orbeez old glow sticks part of a binder things I found around the house here we go let's get this started so I'm not going to enter a coloring contest and I'm not going to enter a video contest I'm going to do a painting I found this in my basement okay so that's free only problem is they don't really make canvases to fit inside so I got something to fix the problem a while back my friends Jamie and Nick gave me some of these ceiling panels from their nursery they were remodeling so I had my husband cut it to the size of the frame. Now this side I am not going to use, okay, because it's rough. I'm going to use the back and I'm going to paint it with ceiling paint for tiles. Uh, I'm just going to paint the surface with that and then I'll use paints from around the house to do the rest. So you never know if you can win something if you don't try. You might as well take a few minutes, few hours, 
consider it a hobby and try to win something. If you do win something, you'll feel great. And if you enter an art show or an art contest, usually they have an opening night with drinks and fancy food and you get to take part in that. Even if you don't win, that's tons of fun. So if you're saying to yourself, I don't know how to find a contest. Well, one, you can do a search on the internet. You can go to your local library and look at newspapers. You'll probably only find local and regional contests in newspapers. And elsewhere, if you also go to your library, you can check magazines. Magazines have contests all the time. Uh, a lot of times they do have sweepstakes. You'll want to stay away from them and go for contests. But my favorite place to look for contests is locally or on the internet. Oh, guess what? In my last video where I talked about free coffee from Panera Bread, this month, guess what I got? Free bagels every day for an entire month. So sign up for those Panera cards. That's it, guys. I'll be in touch with you next week to show you what I painted. And then as soon as I know if I want anything, I'm going to share that with you as well. Be sure to subscribe to stay in touch.